Thank you very much, Kamran. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, um, it's, it's my pleasure to be here. Uh, actually, I signed uh, as a participant of this site event. Uh, at, uh, being honored to be invited as a speaker. Uh, I'm speaking on behalf of the Department of Disease Control, Ministry of Public Health. Uh, <coughs> the, the previous, um, uh, my workplace. Uh, right now, I am the director of National Vaccine Institute, uh, which is uh, a kind of policy body on, on the vaccine, uh, leading for the vaccine safety for the, for the country. But uh, this is also my previous work. Uh, during I was a director of Bureau of Epidemiology at the uh, Department of Disease Control. So uh, just for your information on the epidemiology of dengue in Thailand, just uh, move a, a bit quick because uh, with uh, my limited of time as well because I need to run to the assembly after my talk. Uh, so th Thailand is uh, located at the Southeast Asia and uh, we have, even we have three season, but mostly it's a kind of hot uh, climate. Yeah, we have a little bit cool uh, months in November and January and uh, and after that, uh, it's a hot and humid season, and mostly of the dengue started from the, the, the month of February, March, and April. Uh, and uh, as uh, Dr. Rahman said on the vector, we have two vectors as well, uh, Aedes aegypti and Abopictus. And uh, mostly of the Abopictus, uh, uh, it, it is a vector in the southern part of Thailand especially among the rubber plantation. So, and uh, we, right now we approach uh, on uh, three disease, uh, which uh, a kind of, it's a vector bond of the ED uh, mosquito, like uh, dengue fever and uh, cigar, and as well as chikungunya. Uh, last year we have um, a quite, uh, like a, a big outbreak of chikungunya in the uh, southern part of Thailand as well. So, so right now we approach in, in, a, in a kind of three disease. Uh, we call that uh, one vector that can uh, c control one vector that we can control three diseases. And uh, we do have our surveillance system uh, moved from, from, the, from the, the bottom part that we have at the sub-district level or the village level, we have our a group of uh, village health volunteer to do a kind of primary health care and the community-based surveillance over there. And we have the system on the uh, disease surveillance at the district surveillance system we call the uh, district surveillance information center. And uh, every uh, level that they, they connect together, but uh, right now it's not a hierarchical reporting system anymore because it's online. So when it's uh, reported, it will be uh, at the central level, at the same time at the district, provincial level, or even the regional level. And Bureau of Epidemiology is a center of uh, collecting of the information, analyzing, and uh, report the situation to the policymaker every week that we have uh, the situation brief uh, for, the, for the decision maker. And uh, uh, this is a kind of online uh, reporting system that we, we do have. And we also have the lava, uh, the vector uh, lava survey as well. We use uh, the application uh, on, in the online application and being used by the village health volunteer that they, they can detect, uh, they can collect information of the uh, lava survey, uh, like a container index or household index at the community level. Uh, you can see the, the, the pattern of uh, this is uh, outbreak in, in Thailand that we have uh, through uh, three years uh, in uh, peak of the outbreak uh, uh, that uh, since uh, 2008 and, uh, and to the, uh, 2018. Uh, last year, we actually we expect that uh, we, we may have a, a, a big outbreak, but uh, fortunately we, we have a very good control with the, the strong policy from the prime minister to control the dengue fever in Thailand. So uh, it's a bit uh, lower than uh, expected, but still be a peak of the outbreak 
in uh, 2018, last year. And uh, it's spreading uh, all over the country. We also identified a risk area using the historical data on the uh, disease outbreak and as well as the, the, the larva survey. So we, we call the uh, a kind of uh, high dengue transmission area and especially in the urban area, Bangkok and perimeter province municipality area, uh, as we had in the southern part of the country, they are the kind of hyper endemic area. And we, we do a kind of uh, forecasting every year. Uh, in every December, uh, in, in December of every year, we will provide a forecasting to the, to the public uh, for a kind of warning of the, of the uh, country that uh, we will have a, a big outbreak or not in, in, in the following year. Then uh, for the serotype distribution, we, we have all four serotypes. It's not, um, to, to me, it's not a, a, a quite a good coverage of serotype uh, detection because we don't, we did not uh, uh, do a kind of serotype uh, detection in every case. This is just a kind of laboratory surveillance in the kind of sentinel. So we detect of some of uh, a kind of fluctuation or the kind of a variation of serotype distribution by years, but it's still that uh, there are four serotypes in Thailand. Uh, as uh, Dr. Maliselat talked about the community uh, participation, we, we do have that that uh, we have uh, a kind of, we, we, we use a kind of community engagement activity. Uh, we, as we as said, we have a village health volunteer, which is our uh, a kind of very uh, large group of the people. It's almost uh, uh, 200,000 of village health volunteers all over the country. And they, they, they conduct the program on primary health care voluntarily, not uh, in the, not uh, we did not we did not hire them and uh, and then uh, we we also informed the local government from the municipal uh, municipal area to the province to the regional area so all of the uh, management level uh, be informed according to the situation of uh, their particular responsible area and we use a kind of uh, online application that uh, to report uh, the, the, the system of, uh, no, the situation of the disease uh, through the uh, application and using the uh, kind of uh, program to inform the decision maker. And as well as we inform the public regarding the disease situation and provide the information on personal protection and vector control accordingly. This is a kind of picture that uh, we, we conduct a community engagement activity in, in school, in the uh, a kind of big cleaning day campaign, uh, in the tourist area, in the temple, and in the workplace. So you can see that uh, you know, we need to use a kind of multi-sectoral partners to do, to, to do a kind of vector control. We emphasize a lot on vector control activity. And uh, this is a, a kind of an example of uh, using of mobile application. We call uh, Tandrabad. It's a kind of it actually is a kind of uh, Thai name that we alert and aware of the situation of epidemi uh, epidemic in the country that uh, we are prepared to know on that. That's the meaning of the name Tandrabad, and uh, the. The village health volunteer or the public health officer, they, they will use uh, the application to uh, report on the larva survey so we can get the, a, a kind of container index. And the, uh, this is an example that we've, we found the, the kind of most common container uh, that we found the mosquito larva in, 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 the, in the community, both in indoor and outdoor. <laughs> So in conclusion, dengue is, uh, is a kind of endemic disease in Thailand for a very long time. Uh, and all pseudotypes have been uh, circulated. We have seen more adult cases. Uh, uh, for the 
recent year, we, we've seen more adult cases in Thailand, especially the, the, the adult age over 35. This is a, a kind of um, <coughs> dynamic change of the epidemiology in Thailand. Uh, we still have uh, more cases in children, but we found more uh, percentage of the case in adult. And uh, we also facing on the problem of uh, vector control in urban area because uh, th that's a lot of uh, limitation of community engagement. They have their own uh, personal limitation. Uh, like a public health officer, we, we go there in the, during the, the work uh, during the day, but they, they closed the door. They did not uh, stay there during the, during the day. And so sometimes we need to change off the, the, the time of approaching that we need to go in the community in the evening in, uh, in the urban area. And then the, right now we, uh, we have uh, a group of, uh, uh, of the working like a Bureau of Epidemiology, Bureau of uh, Disease, Con uh, Bureau of Vector-Borne Disease Control, and as well as the National Vaccine Institute. Uh, we are working together to 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 do on the kind of cross-cutting issue as the, Dr. Malasila talked about that we need to work together. Uh, and National Vaccine Institute uh, uh, is also working on the dengue vaccine development. So that's my conclusion and thank you very much for your attention for my talk.